been suffering oil leaks, disintegrating the engines and filling planes with cries and shrieks. It seems that a very important part of the engine was not installed, just overlooked, totally neglected, leaving everyone appalled, resulting in occasional engine failure and or total disintegration, and when engines suddenly missing, it's a complex situation. This can't be a good thing. That was a Rolls Royce Trent 900, but now it's simply gone. And giant hunks of jet engine turbines are sticking out of somebody's lawn. Flying on an Airbus 380 might just give a person pause. Nobody wants to think about disintegrating engines and the problems they might cause. Landing is a much more hazardous affair with wings cracked and spewing fuel. That doesn't seem to be a good way to fly. One would think as a rule. A rule, a rule, a rule. The problem is quite serious. The problem does seem weighty. So maybe till I fix this nagging little problem, I'll avoid the Airbus 380. Yes, the problem does seem quite serious. The problem does seem quite weighty. So maybe till they fix this nagging little problem, I'm a boy. The Airbus 380. Do, 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 do